boss of YouTube is your boss the model. We're back with the final Well, final episode for this game. There might be a second part to this final episode right here, but let's get to it. I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? I can avoid it. No. Holly's sister, Lily. I just don't know what Bigby's doing. If he, if he cares about it. If he even gives a shit. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? We're destroying the tree. No! We're not burning the tree, Snow. Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? Look, uh, maybe a few will get sent up, but you're my friend, Colin. I wouldn't do that to you. Oh God, Bigby! This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Uh -huh. Bigby, wait. When you get the crooked man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. It's the final episode of Wolf Among Us. Wolf Among Us. It's been a long and lonely road. So many crimes unfold on Wolf Among Us. Oh, what for my guys? Oh, what for my guys? What will happen? Oh, what for my guys? Episode five. You've cried all way. You must be tired. And if my envoys are correct, you haven't had a lot of rest recently. Oh, hey, 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 come on now. You can put that gun down. Please, Sheriff, relax for a moment, will you? Do you want a drink? Something to eat? Vivian makes a very nice, very... It's elegant. Really, a carpaccio. It's lobster. Sirloin. I'm here for one reason, and it's not to eat your fucking food. Really? Yeah. What do you think you're doing? He's gonna. Mr. Wolf is our guest, and I have every intention of cooperating. So don't waste the silver. Sit Enough. down, Jersey. Put that gun. Put that gun down. Well, Sheriff. For the sake of transparency, why don't you tell us why you're here? It would help settle everyone's nerves, I think. You're destroying, destroying this town. town. You've been doing it for ages. Destroying this town? What on earth do you mean? What the hell do you think I mean? Slavery? Kidnapping? Extortion? Murder? What would you call the wholesale corruption of Fabled Town? I would call it the baseless accusation of a desperate sheriff. How are you certain this isn't some conspiracy against me? I'm a well-connected man, well-moneyed. People do like to take their shots at me. Who would try to pull that on you? Oh, I don't know. Fables with a grudge. People want a stake in my shops and services. But I can understand the confusion. 
and I'm truly sorry about the trouble all this has caused you. And I hope you believe me when I say, Sheriff, that I sincerely mean to make it up to you. The recent murders that have gotten such attention as of late, I don't relish telling you that they were perpetrated by an employee of mine. It's a very unfortunate bit of business, but I promise you that the matter will be dealt with internally. I just want to settle the issue for you and to assure you that it's over with. You really don't need to worry yourself further. Who did it? An unfortunate bit of business. You're gonna tell me right now who killed him. Sheriff, I have complete respect for you and your job. I hope you know that. But I simply can't divulge that information. You really shouldn't worry yourself. As I said, I've got this under control. No, I'm gonna deal with it right now. Yeah, right. What do you think this is? Some kind of negotiation? What do you think this the is? The man said he'd take care of it. So why don't you take the hint and get out? Tweedledee, please. I was trying to hold that. <clears throat> you know who you did bro. it. Now tell me! No fucking way I'm telling you anything! After what you did! That's enough! I was hoping it wouldn't come to this. His but voice got a little demonic. In the interest of preserving our alliance. If you have to know, it was Georgie. However, like I said, I'd be handling the matter if you don't mind. Georgie. You got what you wanted, so just... Sit. Down. Now. Yeah, I killed him, so what? You should have just kept your nose where it fucking belonged. Why'd you do it? Why kill them? Does it matter? Look, the fact is... George here misinterpreted one of my instructions. Misinterpreted? And I want to make things right. So, let's work something out. What's there to work out? I'm protected, aren't I? Your protection has limits, and I think you've far exceeded yours. But you could murder someone in cold blood like that. You fucking asked me to do this! And then you attempt me to, to kill blame him. me for it. You will be silent while we discuss what to do with you. This is right, bollocks, sis. You're just gonna let him do this? So what do you say, Sheriff? Can we discuss terms? You can have Georgie. Consider it a gift. Ensuring our continued cooperation. What the hell? Take this fucker. Take all of them. I didn't fucking Don't start make this. any trouble, Georgie. Are you seriously throwing me under the fucking carriage after everything I've done for you? I think I'll be taking both of you. You're not taking me, you fucking punts. What the fuck see. is this shit? You said you'd cover for us. For minor infractions, not murder. Just go with him, Georgie. You're gonna sink us all. What's wrong with you people? You're really gonna sell him out just like you that? You think I give a fuck if I'm the one who... the shit do you think you fuckers are? Get the fuck out of I here! I do apologize, Sheriff, but I think it's best if you leave now. There's no way I'm going with him. Are you kidding me? Things are about to get unpleasant, and I would rather you weren't here to watch. You can go join that whore at the bottom of the lake for all I give a shit, but he's not taking me anywhere. I'll roll over on the lot of you before I let that shit happen. What are you saying? Yeah, what the fuck? You're gonna make sure we all go down this shit silent. with you? I'm gonna stay silent. I they, told you. They all fall, uh, crumbling on each other. I wanna, I wanna see where this goes. This could have gone so well. To speak the truth, I've never been a very good mediator. Why negotiate when you can just decide? Lot of scared me. <laughs> Did I miss anything good? Bro, it's well, literally you, one man against stuff. like six or seven, bro. <clears throat> okay, okay. It's the type of games we're gonna play. It's the type of games we're gonna play. Alright, alright. <clears throat> nope, nope, nope. I'm on time. I'm already on time. <clears throat> Over here! Hey, 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 no! You just wasted. You just wasted. You're done, Wolf! Ah, but that's silver. We're pretty much done here. Hey, hey, no, no, no! No, 
No. I'd don't. like to say it was nice knowing you, but I'll be glad get to see you inside. Get away. Get away. Get away. Get away. Nope, 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 nope. Put that down. Put that down. Everybody dying. Put that pool down. This way. Oh no, 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 no. Oh yeah. I gotta get through this portal. But that, I don't know if that's D or dumb. Come on, they're still alive though. Oh, shit! I know. I know. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I'm coming for that. Nope, nope. Come on, then. Come on, then. Come on. Then. Oh. Give me your car. 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 Oh. by one car and it messed up. Let's do that door. Mm -hmm. Found him. We on time. Yep. Go up. Ah. One. No! Dang it. Fuck! We got what the right one. We got the right one. Oh, you know who it is. Oh, you. Oh, okay. You know what? I'm gonna let him have it. Does he just ironically find this suit again? What? I mean, like, why even waste time and look in the car? But bump it. Why not? He's losing a lot of blood. Holy shit! Well, Wolverine, why would you just say that? You, you, you did that. Hang on, I need a minute. Okay. Can you stand up? <clears throat> it's okay. Take your time. Slowly. <clears throat> oh, it's no fucking use. No way I'm walking out of here. How did this happen? Shit. Hello, 
Big B. I hoped you'd come to your senses. <laughs> oh, crooked man's the one you want. But of yeah, course, you're, right. you're too much of an idiot to see that. Or maybe you just like me too much to let me go. I'm gonna rip you to fucking pieces. Oh, go on, then. Please, Sheriff. Haven't you done enough? Look at him. He's dying. You can't seriously want to protect this guy. You know what he did. I'm not going anywhere. Ah, uh, you going with him now? It isn't his fault. He's a murderer. Faith and Lily, he's the reason they're dead. Look, I know he made a few mistakes. We all have. A few? What? He made sure they couldn't talk with those damn ribbons, and then he killed them. You're wearing one yourself. Doesn't that bother you even a little, knowing that man murdered- Of course it does. Those girls- So it's all my fucking fault then. I you didn't fucking... mean- ah! You're gonna throw me to the fucking wolf too? You know I didn't have a goddamn choice. What the fuck? I did what I had to! You can't fucking blame me for that! Look! You didn't have to do anything. Like hell I didn't! Look, Faith and the others tried to pull a run on us. And as you can imagine, the crooked man wasn't too thrilled. But of course, the big boss didn't want to get his fucking hands dirty. So he told me to take care of it. You think I don't know what that means? Either I do what he says or I'm the one getting dealt with. So I fucking killed him. And I'd do it again. Because it's not my fault. Oh. You think that'll help? You still haven't learned, have you? Still the same old fucking moron. Go ahead and kill me then. But it won't bring back Lily or Faith. It won't free your friend Narissa. And I'm just the sap taking the fall for the whole thing. It must be so easy being you. Just come in here and blame me for all this shit. Job's done, right? George is the bad guy. It's all his fucking fault. But what was I supposed to do? You don't know what it's like, Bigby. How could you know? At the end of the day, you're just like him. You could have done anything else. You could have let them go. You could have freed Faith and Lily from those fucking ribbons instead of murdering them. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. If I freed them, what would you have me do? Kill her? Georgie, don't. It was them or Vivian. So you tell me, if free Lily meant she had to die, do you still think I had a fucking choice? Wait, how is she involved in all this? This is the original. The girl with the ribbon. I'm sure you've heard the stories. Couldn't take it off, couldn't talk about it. She used her little purple ribbon to make more of them. To keep our girls quiet. To ensure absolute discretion. You promised you wouldn't. All that magic is connected to this little thing. You remove hers, and the spell's broken. They're all free. But you know what happens to her? The same thing that happened to Faith. So don't you come in here and tell me I fucked up. What the hell, Georgie? We were supposed to look out for each other. I trusted you. You can't fucking blame me. You're not innocent here Dang. either. Wait, those were your ribbons? You're in on this? I thought you cared about them. I do. Of course I do. You have to understand, nobody was supposed to die. When we built this place, it, it was just a stupid idea. A gimmick. Discretion is our guarantee. <sighs> Don't give me Don't no Disney dialogue. I already made up my mind. You and him going. supposed to be our place. I'm spilling both of you. We were going to be in charge for once, and nobody would try to control us or use us. That was the point. Mm hmm And the crooked man showed up, and everything just mm -hmm. turned to shit. So, do you get it now? Why I couldn't just... <clears throat> if you still think it's so fucking simple, then you do it. Go right ahead. Kill her then. What are you doing? Oh, okay. Break the spell. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. No Why doubt. should you get to decide? Either of you. You think this is hard for you? My Bro, life is such room. a fucking burden on your conscience. Don't, don't I get a say? Don't, I'm it's pulling my your life. Like it was either of yours to give up in the first place. You're right. It's your life. I know what I've done. Wait. I'm sick of everyone thinking that they can just. Do what they want with my life. Mm -hmm. I thought it would be different here. 
Okay, are we gonna stop at the dialogue though? Pull the ribbon. I didn't mean. Do you think I wanted to be this person? Oh my god. What I did to I just realized what you got on your. Why do you have a belt on on your dress? Vivian, wait. I every day I have to look Gwen and Hans in the eye and pretend I don't care. Pull the ribbon. Pull the ribbon. Pull the ribbon. I have to forget what I've done to them. Pull it. Pull it. What I took away from them. Pull it. Pull it now. Pull it. I look at Nerissa and I hate myself. Vivian. I can't pretend anymore. What are you Thank doing? you, please. Vivian, don't. Pull it. Vivian, no! Finally, jeez. Fuck! No, 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 no! Why'd you have to do that, Vivian? Vivian! Shit! Just... Jesus. Vivian, I didn't fucking mean it. I was just... Oh, fuck! Get up. Get up! Don't think so, Big B. I'm gonna die here. I think we both know that. Just make sure you give the crooked man the same treatment when you find him. Oh, most definitely. Really fuck him up for me, alright? Alright. For both of us. He's gonna have it worse. Don't worry. Good. Old foundry by the river, alright? Shepherd Metalworks. He'll be there. Fucking asshole. You wanna finish me off now? I mean, do we what get our option? Get me around a little first. Rip my limbs off one by one. Oh, oh, come on now. You gave me the option? Of course Shit, I was gonna. Stop. Come on now. Fuck, just you stop. just told me to do it. I was gonna do it either way. If they give me the option. At least you're and consistent. No more games, alright. We both know how this ends. <laughs> Just make it quick. I know what I did. Yeah, shut up. All right, Georgie. <laughs> Tom. <laughs> Give me that. Give me that. Now we're looking for the crooked man. Now we're looking for the crooked man. Turn the lights off in here. I don't want nobody seeing what we did in here. What we did in here. I'm sorry. I, don't, I was trying to get Snow to like us. Like, I really wanted her to be my girl, but like. At this point, bro, I gotta do what I gotta do. Everybody gotta go. Crooked Man is getting dealt with. We got Georgie out of here. We got the other dude out here. We, we basically got everybody out of here. But. Oh, and Bloody Mary. We gotta get Bloody Mary and the Crooked Man out of here. Of course. Of course, there's a lot of done. So this is where they've been sending these. I'm just so scared to play with this controller because I just, I really don't want it to mess up. I need this controller to stay as good as possible. At least for like the first day of Budokai, please. I need to be able to play. Big B Wolf. Who's, who called me? The big bad wolf. Where are you at? <laughs> Speak to me.
You used to be something. They used to fear you. They'd hide anywhere their small shivering bodies would be. I knew it. It's about time you showed up. I had to take care of some things first. Little errand boy. That's nice. All right. Let's run the one. Ah, Bigby, I see you made it here in one piece. I do apologize, but I have some business to attend to. I leave you in the capable hands of my associate. Come find me when you've finished, dear. Don't worry. This won't take long. Get out of my way, now. Don't make this worse. Aw, he doesn't want to play. I'm sure you'll persuade him. <laughs> <laughs> wow, what a man. Stealing punches while my back is turned. Didn't your mother ever teach you to fight proper? Ah, oh, come on. <clears throat> Lady Mary trying to run the ones, okay. I like that. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Nope, come on. Yeah, yeah, come on. Come on, we on time. Ah. Uh... Mary, don't do this thing, Mary. Glass behind us, window, something. That's how she got. Alright, fuck. Okay, don't get near the lava. Oh, she looks like she got a second form. She red. Circle. I'll let her have that. <laughs> Alright, she got me with that. Where are you? Come out and face me. Behind her. Oh, nah. Nah, bro. Ugh. Watch out. Oh, okay. 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 Jeez, she just going in the front me. Hey, weave. Get off my friend! Dump her in the lava. 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 Get jumped, bro. 
This is like Jariah versus Dankotsky, bro. Come on, don't do this to me. Y'all wouldn't do this to me, right? Y'all wouldn't. Get back. Nope. I. Alright, this is what y'all wanna do, huh? This is what y'all wanna do, huh? Mm. Uh. 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 No, 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 uh. uh. Get off of me! Ah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I knew you had another form in you. I knew you had another form. I knew you had another form. I knew you bad about this form is like you know you can't really do too much you too big you could you could add a, a final form but uh come on i don't i don't crush this oh they just coming out non-stop bro how we gonna know who's who? Oh, oh, scream! Oh, scream! Oh, I thought he was gonna. Ow. Oh. Body. Ah! Can't go for it. Can't take my eye, baby. Is she gone? Is she supposed to turn in the glass? I want to put those clothes back on, bro. No, I'm, I'm just saying. The crooked man right there, he might be stronger than her. We don't even know. You know what I mean? Or maybe he's just a normal guy. Who just got a lot of power. You know? Hello, Bigby. You look tired. Give me one good reason not to rip you apart right now. Oh. This gun holds <laughs> six... Okay. <laughs> I won't miss next time. <laughs> okay. I'm set. Before you do anything with me, I thought I should point out a few things. Mm -hmm. Snow White wants you to bring me back to the woodlands, doesn't she? And that's what I want. You plan to do what she says, don't you? You sure about that? Yes, I'm quite sure. You will bring me back alive. Look, all I ask for is the chance to speak for myself in front of the community. And I'm sure Miss White would agree He's a master that manipulator. I can't let him do that. Trial. Can we at least agree on that? I will have a trial. You need to tell me right now. We're not going anywhere until I get some answers from you. If you want answers, you're going to have to cooperate with me. Look, there's no reason for us to be at each other's throats here. That's funny, coming from a guy pointing a gun at my head. This is just a precaution. I'm sure you understand. I'm no murderer, Mr. Wolf. I didn't kill those women. And I think you know that. All I'm asking for is a chance 
to explain my side of the story. If you're not a killer, then what are you? I'm a businessman, not a killer. There's still a lot you have to answer for. And I will, as long as you agree to my terms. Because I'm not saying another word until I'm brought before the community. I don't mean Why to be looking downwards. But just so we're clear, if you change your mind and decide to do something stupid, you won't get your answers. But you will have a difficult time explaining yourself to Miss White and the rest of this miserable town. I don't know. You're often reckless. And I worry you're not thinking of the let me ask you an honest question. What do you really care about here? Where this case is concerned, I mean. Do you really want the truth? This is about justice. I'm the sheriff. I have to do what's right. Two people were murdered. And you know who did it. Georgie. He's dead, isn't he? My point being, the killer has been dealt with. You've won. You really think I'm that stupid? I understand you have an obligation to bring me in. But you can brighten up a little. It's over. So, shall we get going? I'd rather not dawdle. You know, I'm actually looking forward to seeing Miss White again. All right, let's go. Hand over the gun. I think I'd rather hold on to it, if you don't mind. What do you say? Where are you going? I'm sure Miss White will be pleased. Such a reliable pub. Mm hmm. You're under arrest. You'll be given a trial in front of your peers. <clears throat> and your punishment will follow. I could have chose something else. I could have chose the other option. Why didn't I pick it? Because I thought he was going to zoom in. I know, I know. But I we just... have to do something. Are you fucking kidding me? When is this thing happening? Are we sure he's coming? Yes, you'll have an opportunity to. He's back. <gasps> the crooked man. Thank God. <laughs> Motherfucker. Are you okay? It's been hours. We were worried you'd run into some trouble. At the Crooked Man's place. Well, he didn't make it easy. What happened? It doesn't matter. He's here. We got him. We can talk about it later. You did well, Sheriff. I'm surprised. Not that you did well, but that, you know... I'm just glad you made it back in one piece. It's about time you showed up. Now throw this asshole down the fucking well. Yes, what are you waiting for? You killed Lily! She was my sister! How could you? What do you have to say for Where the yourself? fuck do you get this off? You think you have the right and to just do this to people? You're a fucking to crook! This. You should fucking be ashamed. Shithole. Everyone, can I have your attention? Thank you all for coming here on such short notice. I know normally we'd schedule a formal hearing, but considering the circumstances, I thought it best if we do this as soon as possible. The crooked man is charged with the murder as of I Faith and... As I already informed your sheriff, it was Mr. Georgie Porgy who killed those women, not me. What? It was Georgie? Georgie. I don't mean to interrupt you, Miss White, but I thought it would be unwise to proceed with such faulty information. Georgie may have killed them. But you made the call. Do I have to explain the situation to you again? Wait a minute. So you're saying Georgie's the motherfucker who killed my sister? Well, where is he? Yeah, you're gonna bring that shithead in too, aren't you? Yeah, Sheriff. Where is that rotten scoundrel now? Is he still out there? I sincerely hope not. I killed him. He's dead. He's... what? Dead. So you see, the culprit has been punished. Hey, Bumble, let's just air it all out then. Anything. Let's air it all out. We'll deal with it later, but right now, you're the one I'm concerned with. You called the shots. Georgie made that perfectly clear. In which case, you still have a lot to answer for. And I was I told don't... I would be allowed to speak. We have to read the rest of the charges. What other charges? Fine. Go right ahead. Wait, that's not how this works. After the rest of your crimes are read through, 
Then you will have an opportunity to defend yourself, but only then. If you insist. You are charged with the murder of Faith and Lily, which Georgie carried out on your order, inciting violence against various members of the Fable Town community, including the attempted murder of Sheriff Bigby Wolf. Twice. A misunderstanding. Aiding and providing monetary support for the forced prostitution at the Pudding and Pie. Additionally, you are charged with multiple counts of fraud, extortion, racketeering, and the illegal possession and sale of magical artifacts. And kidnapping Crane at gunpoint. He went willingly. Yes, thank you. Now is there anything you would like to say? <clears throat> First of all, I had nothing to do with Faith and Lily, so you can strike that one from your little record book. Bullshit! Like hell you did Stop the charade. We know you're involved. Come on, it's obvious. I know you're responsible. You've been behind all of this from the beginning. So cut the shit. We all know who you are. We know what you've Just done. Just give it up already. The Crooked Man has committed crimes against this government, and most importantly, its citizens. These charges, if proven, are enough to justify death. Upon which your body will be committed to the witching where it fucking belongs. That's so right. let's get but on with it. We promised you a chance to defend yourself, and I won't rob you of that right. What the You're fuck? Really this is about talk? justice. If we're ever going to pull ourselves together and make something of this town, we have to start doing things correctly. No more snap judgments, no more secrets. We are going to treat everyone fairly, even when they don't deserve it. This is ridiculous. You have the floor. Thank you, Miss White. You've all met Georgie. I don't have to tell you what kind of person he was. He was a total scoundrel, lacking in any sort of moral fiber. I hired him as a favor to his family, you see. A promise kept to a dying mother. Oh, Are you gonna get to your point or what? Georgie was working for me, yes. But he was not acting on my behalf when he killed those women. It was his business. And for whatever reason, I'm sure only he could understand, he murdered two of his most faithful employees. I had nothing to do with it. Tell this is such bullshit! Bull I've always been a bit of a powder keg. Georgie seemed pretty convinced he didn't have a say in the matter. He clearly misunderstood my intention. Really? I would never authorize such an act. Any of you actually believe this bullshit? Holly, please. Tell them, Bigby. When you finally showed up at my door last night, wasn't I more than helpful? I answered your questions. I was willing to cooperate. What's he talking about? You weren't being helpful. You were trying to set me up. Your people tried to kill me. They get a bit carried away sometimes, it's true. Loyal to the end. They do it because they want to protect me, as I protected them. You understand wanting to protect what you care about, don't you? You do I anything. Know. You might even give up an innocent man just to save someone. Yeah, right. They don't do it because they want to protect you. You intimidate people. You scare tactics. They're afraid if they don't follow orders, they'll end up dead. Let me explain this to you. My employees are just that. Hired help. I see some of them are here among you. They are not my slaves. They are all free to make their own decisions, as Georgie was. True. What about Lily? She wasn't free. She wasn't given a choice. Do you really think she wanted... that any of those girls wanted their lives like that? I'm sorry, Holly. I'm sorry that your sister asked me for help, and I'm sorry that I decided against my better judgment to give her a distasteful job. Right, and you kept them in debt so they couldn't leave. Yeah. That's what you did to us. How you kept us all you in line. You forget it was not me who put you in that position. Mm -hmm. You all act like I'm some kind of tyrant. He's talking. He's talking now. He's when talking now. When your government abandoned you, left you poor and helpless, sniveling on street corners, I was there to look out for you. Beauty yes, and the Beast, that's y'all for. Wasn't I? Crane was the one who let this town go to the fucking dogs. The guy who was in your pocket, remember? Really? What about Auntie Greenleaf? Her story is not uncommon. She left everything she had back in the homelands. Everything that matters, anyway. 
With nowhere else to turn, she came to me for help. And what did I do for you? You got my tree back. I got her tree back. And in turn, we used her magic to help poor Fables get glamours. Because I helped her, she was able to make a living. Provide you, for you herself. You chose this business instead and of playing basketball, though? For the longest time, not much. But they asked me to come work for them. Really? The new deputy mayor wants you on the 13th floor? No. The wolf offered me the job. She wanted my tree destroyed. If she had had her way, I'd be hung out to dry on a clothesline by now. What? You were gonna burn her tree? Snow, why would you want that? Is that true? Snow? She I'm was helping that. people glamour themselves as other fables. We couldn't let that continue. It wasn't her fault. You can lie to yourself, but you can't lie to me. You hated Crane, and you hated him for wanting to fuck you, and you being too oh. soft to notice what he'd do to get it. It oh, had nothing to okay. do with a crooked it's man. It's see for everybody tonight. Okay. We've made some mistakes. I. He's still getting go the crooked mistakes. man is still getting spilled. By the way, he, he's not safe. I'm, I'm taking him out. Want what's best for this town. No doubt. And that may not always be clear right away, but I want you all to know that I care deeply about all of you. And she so reminds me of Wonder Woman. Yeah, right. I can't promise you perfection. No one can. But I can promise to always have your talk. best interests at heart. Like you did with her? Which is why the Crooked Man must be punished for his crimes. The Crooked Man's been exploiting you. Exploiting your hope for a better life. He just you gonna get a go whole new crew if we let him out. And he would take that weakness and add it to his strength. And if things didn't fall exactly his way, someone would die. Do you really think the crooked man cared about you? He just cared about your money. He cares about your obedience. They're right. You're all still afraid of him, even now. But you needn't be. His contamination of this town is over. And those girls will have their justice. Very good, very good. The sentiment is surely appreciated, Miss White. But it doesn't disguise the fact that these accusations are I still got a feeling he's a demon. Go ahead and show your true colors. He doesn't have a particle of evidence linking me to the. Georgie body. was working for you. Bigby got a confession. A confession that, that nobody heard. Now, I'm no barrister, but I think such a statement would carry more weight if Bigby weren't the only one to whom Georgie spoke, especially given Bigby's history. What are you talking about? Snow? So, are we done? And what about your history? All you've done to this fucking town? Mm -hmm. What do you mean there's no evidence? Maybe, maybe he's... I mean, this doesn't feel right, how we're doing this. I just Of need... course it's right. This man tormented all of you for spill profit. Him, I'll spill him Georgie myself. killed Let me just him. make sure I understand you. You're trying to say that I'm responsible for what Georgie did, because he was working for me at the time, yes? Yes. Of course. Where are you going with this? Well, by that logic, Miss White should be on trial for Tweedledum's murder. Since you know Bigby works for her. That's... He killed a man. Now don't make him a murderer. Doesn't it? Bigby and I have already discussed his behavior that night. We're handling it internally. Now, where have I heard that before? How about the way he treated poor Tweedle D when he was in your custody? He was beaten to mashed apples while under your watch. Under my watch? Maybe he's right. Did you think we'd all just let that go? You can't be serious. That was different. What? Snow had nothing to do with it. We all thought she was dead. Besides, Crane was still deputy mayor when that happened. Right before you decided to kidnap him. It was for his own protection. Oh, you're right, dear. Crane was in charge. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference. That's enough. So... You won't answer for your employee's behavior, but I must perish for This mine. is completely different. I we did all... not order those two girls dead. It simply 
never happened. Georgie killed Faith and Lily. End of story. They want to scapegoat me for their own tangled ends, but they refuse to answer for their own this crimes. This isn't right. Oh, please. This isn't the point. We'll deal with them after we deal with you. Listen, I the know. Laws of Does he voice that rocket? I think, he, I think that's please. rocket. What's that supposed to mean? I mean, a certain level of privilege should be afforded to three. To who? This is how it's always been. We lashed our ropes to this diseased world, and ever since, which one of us has been there for you? Who filled your lives with the promise of more? Who was there while they idly played in their towers, judging you, treating you as mindless children, too stupid to command your own destiny? Without me, who will pay your rent when you're on the verge of eviction? Who will dare challenge their brutality when it leaks to our dear citizens? Beast and beauty, if y'all don't get a job and just work for y'all money, and stop taking out loans Maybe? and getting in debt. White. Excuse me, I, dear. I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say something. Why don't you take a moment to catch your breath? Say she that ribbon off. I'd like to... I, I need to say something. We're kind of in the middle of something. Go ahead. Uh, of course. Go right ahead. You probably don't remember me. I don't know why I was... Afraid to come My here. Dear, I don't Just shut you... up. You enslaved us for years. Let us hear stories about what you do. Told us we would lose everything if we stepped just one toe out of line. And we couldn't say a word about it because of these damn ribbons. Hey. But you know what? Now it's my turn to talk. How are you? I found Vivian's body. Did you kill her? Did he? Sheriff, this is highly irregular. Be quiet. Vivian killed herself back at the Thank pudding and pie. I'm sorry, um, I don't think I'm Nerissa! Knew. My name is Nerissa. It's okay, my dear. It's going to be just... He ordered them dead. This fucker. Faith and Lily... That's a lie! I was in the goddamn room when he did it! Faith and Lily are dead because of you. The only two people who ever gave a damn about me. This just confirms it. He made Georgie do it. It was always him. Georgie would have never done anything without his say-so. Ever. You're going to take the word of a stupid... At least five other girls will back me up on this. We all heard you say it. Did you now? Looks like we found our evidence. She saw it firsthand. He's guilty. Good enough for me. Me too. So, that's it, right? Calm down the witching well. Nah, no, that's too fucking easy for a crook like that. What do you mean? He's gotta pay for what he did. Listen to yourselves! You're all rats, fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. What, you take two people's lives away and now you want mercy? You know we can't yeah, no, that's free rocky. after this. Wait! I could always rip your arms off first. Would you enjoy that? Well done, then. Now, for your sentence. We don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that, but we don't have to kill anybody. We can imprison well, him. What are we going to do? Lock him up forever. Somewhere he can never hurt anyone again. Oh, my God. How can we be sure he won't escape? I can help. We'll use magic. That's not good enough. Yeah, no, no, no. You work with him. No, 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 no. I'm a pack granny up and I'm a pack him up. I'm a pack granny up and I'm a pack him up. Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment. So I think we. This is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? I hope you aren't suggesting yourself. Why not? What about a vote? What do you think this is? Everyone, calm down. Look, Putting this in my I'm making the call. Why should you? He is the only officially appointed representative here. Right. Bigby should decide. That makes sense to me. Mm -hmm. I guess it does. Okay. Fine. Are you sure? This isn't how it's... It's what the people want, Miss White. Okay. Mr. Wolf, it's your call. It's Noah. Just do what you think is right. Give me the options. Put the options on my screen. Yes, Sheriff. <laughs> Buddy, you're getting spilled. You think is right. Buddy, you're getting spilled. Buddy, you're getting spilled. <laughs> Everyone, I'm 
Not this way. Oh, oh, hold on now. Hold on now. Hey, 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 somebody help me, man. Somebody help me, man. Come on, man. What's your problem, man? What's your... <clears throat> there you are. I hope you all remember this moment. Think of me when you try to sleep. Shut You're up. going to miss me. No, I won't. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Give me your head. Give me your head. I think I want your head. Mm. Oh, my God. Oh. Type time and I'm on. Yeah. This is the head of the crippled man. Oh, wait, that wasn't his name. Okay, wrong, 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 wrong faith. Reference. Yes, another one of us to erase from the books. Hey, Sheriff. Are you gonna come see the truck off? We're leaving for the farm in a few. Thought you might want to. I don't know. I'll be down in a minute. Okay. Great. This fucking line. Oh, uh, Mr. Wolf? Flycatcher left his keys. Right. Thanks. I'm... I'm sorry, Sheriff. I have to take care of this. We'll talk later, okay? Good morning, Miss White. <sighs> You're late. Someone's gonna see you, Colin. Dang, still more. Oh, Gowan! Jesus! We only have like five minutes. They carry me for fuck's sake! I don't give a shit! We forgot these. Oh, thank you. It's uh, been pretty busy around here. Morning, Sheriff. Nice fucking day. Oh, shit! Just go grab that, would you? Sorry about all this. Uh, I tried to help. Just why the hell did she have to send me and me boy away, huh? You promised me I'll get another chance. But Miss White said I had to go up to the damn farm anyway. I told her I had the money, but she didn't want to hear it. Wait, Sheriff Bigby. I have something. <laughs> you know, he was up crying all night, poor kid. Can you give this to Miss White, please? Dad says there's no time to say goodbye, so... If you could bring it to her... Yeah, is sure. it a bomb? I couldn't take them all with me, and she said she liked that one the best. It's a willow beetle. That's a big one. They're cool, cause when... Um, the video's finna end. I will start a part two of this. For the end part, I hope y'all enjoyed this series, bro. It was very fun playing this game. My footage on this video is from the end zone. I can't really explain how much I love this game, but I'm so happy I beat it. 
and yeah uh see you guys in the next video i'll explain later